Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much again for joining me. I hope you're all keeping safe and well during this isolation period. Today, however, we have a very exciting video for you. We have Geek Gear's limited edition Luna Lovegood box. I am beyond excited for this box, you guys. It was delayed and delayed and delayed again because of everything that's going on at the moment. Geek Gear have done an amazing job again at keeping us all informed, getting this to us as quickly as possible, and they have promised that this is gonna be a really exciting box. So I'm gonna get straight on into it and open this on up. Okay, so to prepare for this box, I have on my Luna Lovegood Spectrospect necklace, I have my Luna Lovegood wand to hand, and I am ready to rip into this box. I am super excited. As always, I will give you a sneaky peek. Not much of one, but we'll see what we've got on top of here. I believe it is a t-shirt. Let's get all these wiggly worms off. They're all stuck to the t-shirt. Okay, I will let you guys see first. What do you think? Do we like? Ooh, oh, okay. Ooh, we have a very small t-shirt design. So as you can see, it's Luna's trainers hanging from the ceilings in one of the hallways in Hogwarts. I love that scene at the end where she's obviously trying to find all her missing items and she spots her shoes and she's like, I think I'll have pudding. So yeah, we actually really like that t-shirt. It's on a really simple black t-shirt and obviously then it's got the really small design in the corner. And I think with this design as well, it's quite subtle. If you're not an avid Harry Potter fan, you're not necessarily going to get right away that this is Harry Potter. And I think that it's a really, really sweet little design as well. So I really do like that t-shirt, gotta be fair. Okay, so once again, you're not seeing an awful lot through all the wiggly worms, but I'm going to try and move some out the way and find something to have a look at. Okay, we've got a little box. What is in here? Okay, so this is just a plain white box. So this could literally be anything what have we got oh my god i can see from the top already what this is yes oh my god yes 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 i love this that is brilliant holy moly you guys are you seeing this look what we have we've got an absolutely gorgeous little luna figurine with her lion headdress on that is amazing i've seen like there's um, a rock candy pop funko type style one of this but it's quite rare to get your hands on and it's really difficult and I haven't got one. So this is so cute. It's painted so well. It's absolutely adorable. Just look at her. Wow, that is a great style. That is really, really sweet and such a great item to get in this box. Super, super impressed with that, gotta be fair. Okay, so let's have another lucky dip. Oh, okay, I'm pulling something out here. This is cool. We can see Spectra Specs. Oh, we have ourselves a banner. This is kind of cool. You're just as sane as I am. I love that. I think this is so cool. So obviously it's got two little hooky things here where obviously you can hang it up. You've got the spectra specs. You've got some stars going around it. That is really sweet. I'm gonna take it out of the packaging so we can get a better look. Okay, so I've taken it out of the packaging now so you can see it a little bit better. That is really sweet, I love that. And I will definitely be displaying this. Uh, I need to find somewhere really nice to pop it. But that is a super cool little item. So loving that as well. Okay, so there is something really big in here that I don't wanna look at yet. I feel like that's gonna be something cool. Okay, so what have we got here? Oh my God, this is the box that keeps on giving, guys. This is so cute. We have Luna's earrings. I'm gonna take them out of the packaging again because you can't see it too great at the moment. I love these so much. So as you can see, they are her little earrings. People think that these are either uh, turnips, I think, or they could be the dirigible plums. I can't remember exactly what the book says. I think they're dirigible plums, but I think people do get them mixed up with turnips. But either way, whether the turnips or dirigible plums, these are a very iconic Luna Lovegood item, and that is amazing to get into a subscription box as well. They're stainless steel earrings with like beadings all over it. They are absolutely beautiful. This box is just so good, you guys. I can't get over it already. I'm just so, so happy. Okay, right, back into a lucky dip. What else have we got? Ooh, oh, okay. I see you. So we have a Luna Lovegood necklace, just like mine I have on here. I don't know if you can see that too well. I've got the Spectrospect glasses. This is another one. Let's take that out of the packaging. There we go. So this one is gold, and you can see we've got a lovely red and blue gem in there as well. Is that red or is it pink? That definitely looks more reddish on here. 
Um, yeah, that is beautiful. I really do like that. It's something that I will wear. Um, you can obviously wear that as like a cosplay thing or you can wear it just day to day. Who doesn't love Spectra Specs? And obviously, again, it's another iconic Luna Lovegood item. So I am all for that great item. I'm gonna have a little look now because I'm not sure where I'm going. We still have quite a few bits and bobs in here. I'm gonna try and get this up next. What is this? Is it a towel? Oh, it might be a cushion cover. Let's have a look. Okay, so we have a cushion cover. How gorgeous is that? This is such a cool cushion cover. As you can see, we have the Quibblet down here. We have the Spectra Specs. We have Luna's wand. We have a Ravenclaw scarf. What is that? Oh, we have her earrings down here as well. And we've got a pocket watch. That is such a pretty pillowcase and it's really soft. It's, this actually feels like a really good quality pillowcase. It's got a little zip at the bottom as well. So obviously you can put your pillow into the pillowcase itself. And I just think that's really beautiful. This is actually a pillowcase that I would proudly put on my sofas for everybody to see or on my bed, something along those lines. That is gorgeous. I really, really like that. Okay, so I think we're on the last but one item. I think there's a print in the bottom, but I'm very intrigued by this. This looks like a potion bottle but I'm not sure. It doesn't look like there's anything inside here. I'm just gonna try and open this on up. Okay, so it's got a wax sealed top and it is, oh my God, that's genius. I love it. That is brilliant. So this bottle is stunning, guys. I mean, can we just appreciate the shape of this bottle? This proper gives me like genie in a bottle vibes. This is beautiful. And then we've got a cork stopper with a wax seal. And then we have this little tag around there and then a little description of what's inside this bottle. And it says, Nargles. So it says, no one seems to believe me that Nargles are real. You'll need to wear some special glasses to see them. Luna Lovegood. Sorry, the writing's a bit scrolly, so I couldn't quite read that then. But yeah, it says Luna Lovegood on here. Nargles are attracted to mistletoe. Avoid contact as unwanted side effects may occur. And obviously you can see the bottle is empty, but when you have your Spectra Specs on, you should be able to see the Nargles inside. I love that, that is such a clever idea. One that I would never have thought of myself. Absolute genius, I love it. And the bottle is just really, really beautiful as well. I absolutely adore it. Okay, so that just leaves us with the print which I love. It looks like a pencil sketch. Look how beautiful that is. So you've got a nice big Luna in the middle with her wand. Then you've got one over here where she's kind of looking up and she's got her quibbler, which is upside down, of course. And then we've got one over here where she's also holding the quibbler and she's got her spectra spec glasses on. How stunning is that? That is such a beautiful, beautiful print. This is something that I will proudly display. I can't wait to find a really beautiful frame to pop this in and I will display this really, really proudly. This is one of the most beautiful prints that I've got from a Geek Gear box ever. I'm not just saying that because it's Luna and we all love Luna. But yeah, this genuinely is really, really stunning. I really can't wait to get that up. So it does have a cheat sheet inside as well. So I will quickly run through everything that we had just to make sure we did get everything and everything is here. So the first one is the exclusive Luna Lovegood Lost Shoes t-shirt. Then we have the exclusive Luna Lovegood themed cushion cover, the exclusive Luna Lionhead figurine, the exclusive Lovegood dirigible plum earrings. So they are dirigible plums. I thought they were, but obviously people do get them mixed up a lot of the time with turnips. So you can see sometimes why people get a bit confused. Uh, then we have the exclusive Luna Lovegood Spectra Spec necklace, the exclusive Nargles potion with intentionally crumpled label. That's what it says underlined, intentionally crumpled. So that is not some sloppiness on their behalf. This is intentionally done. <laughs> I love that, that's so funny. And then the exclusive Luna quote, you're just as sane as I am flag, with the exclusive Luna Lovegood compilation, the community artist artwork, uh, this lovely Luna compilation is brought to you by Michelle Ann Art. Show Michelle some love on Facebook and then it's got her uh, details on there, which I will put in the description down below so you can go check out her artwork because in fairness, that print is stunning. It's really, really gorgeous. The prints lately in Geek Gear boxes are absolutely knocking it out of the park. They have all been so beautiful and stuff that I would actually really proudly show off in my home. So that is something really special, I think. So the YouTube spotlight this week is Phoenix 2. And then we have next month's hint is Harry in his pajamas with the egg from the Cobbler of Fire. I don't know if that's the hint for maybe the next limited edition box or for the next standard box, but I've probably got a feeling it's for the limited edition box, to be honest. So let's talk about this box, you guys. 
wow they promised us a really good box and they have absolutely knocked it out of the park this was absolutely amazing obviously it was really delayed was it worth the wait 100 this was such a strong box this was definitely the best limited edition box i've received so far and i have received about two or three at this point um, and that was seriously the best one that we've had to date i am really really pleased with everything that we had in this box nothing i've kind of picked up i've gone mm, yeah that's okay it's a, it's a nice item but it's not really my thing everything is absolutely brilliant i'm so so pleased with this box let's talk favorites and non-favorites can i even pick this time around i don't think so um no i can't i'm looking around at these items and i'm just like no they're all brilliant i suppose if I had to pick a worse word, it might be the flag, but not because it's a bad item, it's just maybe not the most exciting of this box, but everything else is just stunning. We've got the necklace, we've got the little figurine, we've got the Nargles potion bottle, which is just genius. That print is stunning. Everything in this box was just so, so good, and I'm so pleased that I did get this box because I think I would have been devastated if I had missed out on it, to be honest. So yeah, what did you think guys? Pop a comment down below. What was your favorite item? Did you get Luna's box as well? Have you missed out on it this time and you are devastated? Pop any comments down below you guys and I'll reply to as many of you as I possibly can. I do hope you really enjoyed my video. If you did, please give it a magical thumbs up so I know that you're enjoying my content. And obviously if you are not subscribed already, please do consider subscribing to my channel for more magical goodness. And I will see you very soon in my next video. Bye you guys.